Everyone welcome back. So it's pretty rare for Rockstar Games CEO to do interviews, right? But ever since GTA 6 was officially revealed late last year, he's been stepping up and doing more interviews. And as we get closer to the 2025 release date, this is only going to ramp up even more. Now when GTA 6 was first announced, all we got was a vague release year, 2025. No specific month or quarter, just the year. They're known for keeping things hush-hush until they're sure about everything, but now we've got a little more info on the timeline. The latest buzz is that GTA 6 is set to drop in Autumn 25. That means it could release anywhere between September 22nd and December 21st, which exciting. is exciting. So while we don't have an exact date yet, at least we've narrowed it down to a season. GTA 5, if you remember, came out a bit earlier on September 17th, 2013. But it looks like GTA 6 will hit the shelves later in the year. The best part? It seems like Rockstar is sticking to that 2025 release window. But as always, with video games, things can change. Let me know your thoughts in the comments. Are you hoping for an early or late autumn release? Now I've got to keep it real with you guys. Even though Rockstar is aiming for fall 2025, there's always the chance of delays. This is super common in the gaming world, and while GTA 6 won't get cancelled, don't worry about that, a delay isn't impossible. We could see it get pushed into 2026 if they hit any roadblocks. But here's the good news. After the release of Red Dead Redemption 2 in 2018, Rockstar made some internal changes to avoid crunch time, meaning developers won't be rushing to finish the game. So in my opinion, a delay might not be super likely, but it's always something to keep in mind. What I love about Rockstar is how much they've learned from the past. After the whole crunch controversy with Red Dead Redemption, too, they've really made an effort to space out work and give the team more time to polish everything. That's why I think the chances of a last minute delay for GTA 6 are smaller. But still, delays are part of the gaming world. Either way, it looks like that they're being super careful to avoid those last minute fixes that usually cause delays. Are you guys cool with waiting a little longer if it means getting a perfectly polished game? Let me know in the comments below. Now, while we don't have an exact release date yet, I'm pretty confident we'll get one when Trailer 2 drops later this year. Rockstar is really good at keeping us on our toes, but I think they'll finally give us a solid date with that trailer. And not just that, we'll probably get more details about the storyline, characters, and even some new gameplay footage. I'm so excited to see what they've been cooking up. Once Trailer 2 drops, pre-orders should start rolling out. And from there, things are going to pick up speed. Though, so, if you're hyped for Trailer 2 like I am, don't forget to smash that like button and subscribe for all the latest updates. What's crazy is that the gap between Trailer 1 and Trailer 2 is going to be the longest time. We'll have to wait for GTA 6 info. But once that second trailer hits, the floodgates will open. We're going to get more trailers, more advertisements, and tons of new info leading up to the release. It's going to be wild. So, if you want to stay in the loop, make sure to subscribe and turn on notifications so you don't miss a thing. I've got you covered with all the updates as we get closer and closer to GTA 6 launch. Alright, here's something fun. I want to hear your guesses. Since we know GTA 6 is releasing in autumn 2025, which date do you think it will drop? Between September 22nd and December 21st, anything is possible. Drop your best guesses in the comments, and let's see who can predict it accurately. I'll even come back to this video after the game releases to see if anyone got it right. So make sure to leave your predictions below and let's have some fun with it. Who knows, maybe one of you will nail the exact date. Now let's talk about the future of GTA 6 news. Once Trailer 2 drops, we're going to be swimming in information. Rockstar is known for doing things big and I expect the next few months to be packed with exciting reveals. We're talking story details, character insights, gameplay mechanics, and more. But what are you guys most excited to learn about? Is it the new map, the storyline, or maybe the multiplayer mode? Let me know in the comments. I want to hear what you're most hyped for. And as always, if you're enjoying the content, hit that subscribe button for more updates. The hype around GTA 6 is real, and I know you all feel it too. 
We've been waiting for years, and now that we're finally getting closer, it's hard not to get excited. Autumn 25 feels like it's just around the corner, but the wait is definitely going to be worth it. Rockstar always delivers when it comes to their games. And I have no doubt that DTA 6 will blow us all away. So if you're as pumped as I am, make sure to stick around because I'll be keeping you updated every step of the way. Before we wrap up, I want to say a huge thank you to everyone who's been tuning in and supporting the channel. Your comments, likes, and subscriptions mean the world to me. And I love hearing from you all about what you're most excited for with GTA 6. We're getting so close to the big day, and I'm so grateful to have you all on this journey with me. So if you haven't already, make sure to hit that subscribe button and give this video a thumbs up. It really helps the channel grow and keeps you in the loop for all things DA6. All right, that's it for today's video. We covered a lot of ground, from the potential release window of Autumn 2025 to the excitement building around Trailer 2. There is so much to look forward to, and I can't wait to see what Rockstar has in store for us next. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to like, subscribe, and leave your guesses for the release date in the comments below. I'll be back soon with more updates, so stay tuned, and I'll see you in the next one. It's not a game, it's a red skin.